Hello YouTubers. Please excuse the shouting in the background. Somebody's telling their child off for something. So, it's been a little while. It's been about a week since I made a video or really was into the YTPC scene. Um, it seemed longer because I've been busy. Um, so I've been really more involved with my political videos um, because there's been quite a bit going on with British politics um, and some interesting things with world politics and American politics and stuff like that. But for whatever reason I've decided to have a look at what was going on in my regular sort of channel and noticed a comment saying congratulations on winning the competition and that was from Dirty Boots and that comment was already three days old so I realised that I'd entered this competition and then just other things overtook me, work mostly. Probably should mention housekeeping. This is my Peterson summertime pipe. It's the 408. Nice yellow stem. Is this the 2017? Or 2016 when does it say on here no it doesn't and I can't remember but obviously it's an army mount nice yellow acrylic stem and it was supposed to be a blue bowl but in the time I've had it it's kind of faded yeah And inside it, I've got the summertime tobacco of that year. I've got three jars of summertime tobacco from Peterson. The 2018, 2017, 2016. So maybe this is from 2016. As I say, I've forgotten now. Yeah, so I was shocked to find that find that comment and I sent a quick message saying, you know, sorry, I haven't been into the YTPC for about a week now. And um, I went over and checked his video out and saw my name being plucked out of the tin. So I really appreciate that. Thank you very much, Dirty Boots. I'll obviously make a video when the pipe arrives. It looks like a beautiful pipe. I'm really pleased to have won. As you said, um, giveaways seem to become a thing that's not going on at the moment, but you know, I think if the sentiments behind it is genuine, it's not a bad thing. And I'm sure his sentiments are absolutely genuine because he seems like a really genuine, nice guy. So um, I'm sure it wasn't done to just to try to... I know it wasn't. It wasn't done just to boost sort of numbers. Um, and he's a very modest guy and seems a very genuine guy. I'm puffing on this pipe a little hard because I know that while I'm talking the likelihood is it'll go out so I don't want that to happen 
I'm just going to pause a sec while I collect my thoughts. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. <clears throat> so, as I said, I haven't been watching many videos. I haven't had time even to smoke a pipe in the last week. This is the first pipe I've smoked. Yeah, in about got to be it's got to be over a week it's probably something like um, 10 days or something like that since I smoked because I've been that they're doing that many extra shifts um, and extra work I did um, I did a double shift at a station that's right the other side of the brigade, it's about a two hour drive and on the motorways in the Midlands if you get the time wrong you, you're stuck in traffic jams for hours so what I did I drove to this station which is, I mean it's literally the furthest station from my station and my station is right on the sort of western border and the other stations as far east as you can go and uh, so I drove there, I did my 12 hour shift and then when I finished there's a bit of a grass field behind I, I put my little one man tent up, did a bit of wild camping, just put the tent up while it was dark, um, kicked down without anybody noticing I was there, slept and it was pretty much raining all night, slept out got up next morning, unpacked packed my tent away, started my shift and uh, for all they knew I'd gone home but I hadn't I'd done a bit of wild camping. So yeah, I've been doing loads of shifts so I've been too busy really for making videos, even for smoking a pipe. But um, you know, when I do get a chance to watch some videos, um, I mean, I think it's hard to say there's that many different types of pipe videos in the YTPC. Um, there's a lot of choice and dirty boots really is a, a, a breath of fresh air for pipe smoking channels. What I love about it is he shows you areas in, you know, over in Eastern Europe where he lives and, and it's some of the areas are breathtakingly beautiful and you really feel like you're seeing seeing another part of Europe that you you know we don't see um, I'm thinking about uh, taking a holiday somewhere over there that, somewhere that way and Prague's probably a fascinating place to visit so yeah anyway thanks very much Dirty Boots and thanks everybody else for watching this video and I just can't wait really to uh, see this beautiful pipe. Ta-ra.